Welcome back, guys, to The Witcher 3, the next-gen update. So I've got a surprise for you all. I'm about to turn around, and I'm about to show you what this game is capable of on PC. We just played the first part on PS5, which, by the way, if you've got a PS5 and you like this game, you will not be disappointed. But on PC, with ray tracing and everything at max, it's hard to believe that this game is seven years old or so i guess technically we could we could say this is part two i don't know if i'll be doing a full series just yet i know this game is very long and i don't know we'll see but uh let me just turn around and show you guys the absolute beauty of ray tracing and the sunrise or sunset excuse me I mean, this is almost Red Dead Redemption level, lighting-wise. I mean, look at how beautiful. <laughs> this is this is incredible. This is how I like to play games, where run Roach, where it's so beautiful it doesn't even feel real. Okay, does that make any sense? I don't know. But anyways, we've got to go ahead and collect our reward from the Nilf Guardians. We officially actually am i going the right way that's it roach uh i believe so hold on we've officially slayed our first beast our first monster i think we've actually got to go this way um yeah this way place of power should draw from it okay we were there already i just figured out by the way that i could actually jump on horse i don't think it was possible but i was mistaken Dude, look at the lighting. Oh my goodness gracious. Bro. Like, what in the world is this? Oh my That's god. This is... This is my first time booting it up on PC, okay? Um, I got the code yesterday, but I had to do the whole cross-save thing and whatnot. So, I didn't really get a chance to boot up the game, but this is... This is crazy. This is so crazy. Um, just a little bit, a little bit further. All right, here we go. Ooh, that's a nice little trick there, Geralt. Is it true? Northern women bathe once every three. Oh, that's disgusting. Too much info. All right. What the hell is this? Roy. You take me for a blind man or a fool? This grain is rotten. I, I didn't know. So, a fool. Damn it, you never learn. Military Codex, Article 2, Section 3. For the delivery of defective goods, 15 lashes with a knout. Make it so. No, no, no! By the gods, no! What? Guess you've dropped your good uncle act. It was no act. I extended a hand to these people. They spat on it. Could it be because it held the sword that killed their loved ones? Tja, a moralist. And what would you do in my stead? Wouldn't ever be in your stead. Tell me why you've come. Fulfilled my end of the bargain. Your turn. Where'd Yennefer go? To Vizima. She was a day's ride from here the whole time? Under my nose? Might have said so. Yes, I might have. But you would not have killed the griffin. Tit for tat. Man, the... Halt! We are not done. It's yours, this gold. I would not want you to say you were inadequately compensated. So dialogue, time constrained options. Some dialogues demand you to make a quick decision. Choose your reply before time runs out. Take the coin. Damn, I don't know. I'll turn down the coin. I'm gonna be a good guy. Make him feel like a piece of turd. I'm 
Do they have him in there? Oh god, they're whooping his ass. Bro, they are slapping him up. Oh god. Can I just kill these people and free him? Poor soul. Talk to the commander. Oh damn. Will someone explain to me why you are here? Is there nobody that I can speak to here? Okay. Fine. Well, thank you. You guys are rude. Yes. Nordling. Well, there's nobody I can talk to here. What the hell? Hmm. Maybe, maybe that's just his fate. I have my eye on you, Nordling. To be honest, I'm glad we can't speak Poor to everyone. Because if we could, then that, that'd be just really crazy. I'm going to go here real quick. Go to the character. And as promised, I will upgrade. Let me see here. Time's uh, slowed by an additional 50% while aiming the crossbow. Okay, I'm going to go ahead. Strong attack damage. Um, I'm going to upgrade this one more time. How should I be playing this game? Should I be attacking uh, certain quests or what's the deal? There's something there. Okay. I'm still trying to figure out how to how to tackle this game. I know it's 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 a lot to take in and I've heard that if uh, you're like if you reach a certain area and you're under leveled, it's just going to be a pain Come in the on. ass. Okay. All right. So as promised last time, I said I was going to read the bulletin board. If you guys remember. So here we have six different. Uh, I'm not sure what this is. The death to the invaders. Hark, fair folk of the north. If you are yearning for freedom, if you are prepared to take up the arms to defend the motherland, head to the woods. We grow stronger by the day and will soon show Nilf the Nilf Guardians of vermin that the Temerian nation will know will not bear its yoke without a fight if your heart bleeds blue with golden lilies and will uh, you will soon die for your country you will sooner die for your country than live as a slave to foreigners let us swear by our fathers who fell for the beast of at sodden by the souls of the dead buried at brenna to arms okay so what, what is that all about okay let's see Quests. Oh, this is scamming. Ooh. These are the ones we've done. Huh. Read the document you found. Okay. I find that in the glossary, perhaps? Books? Of sweat and blood. In this panel, you can browse through the contents of all the books and the scrolls you have found. Even if you later sell a book, its contents will still be available here. On the left, you can select the book and scrolls and letters in their contents to be shown in the center of the screen. Whenever I would ask the Witcher for his opinion concerning my latest sonnet, uh, elegy, or even a couple or or even couplets, he'd claim he'd always claim he hadn't the time. Yet time he had a plenty. When it came to reading the letters, fawn and corpses are lying about monsters' nest. Perhaps that was because they, unlike my writings, often proved the path to significant riches. Find the lost Marian treasure using the Witcher senses. Okay. Search the castle ruins. Alright, you know what? Let's... Oh, this is cool. Okay. Nice. And bada bing bada boom. It is gorgeous outside, Roach. Let's go! It is so freaking nice. Woo. All right. Let's see what we've got here. This is interesting. Hmm. I wouldn't be surprised if there are some beasts 
lurking in this area. Run, Roach. Oh shit. Hold on. What do we have here? Aha. Uh -huh. Yo, that's hilarious. A deserter. Hey, I don't want to I don't want to kill. I wasn't even going to kill you. Man, I wasn't even going to kill you guys. So you decided to come here. I don't want to fall off. So you know what? Ooh. You're dead. No, you're dead, punk. Look, I'll even use my fit. Oh, I just chopped off his neck. For lack of a better term. Okay. They were searching for something here. Chicken sandwich. Why, thank you. Achievement. String and another rusty sword. What am I supposed to fucking die for? Tamaria? Dad died for that. So did my three brothers and... What that, and, and so did my three brothers. But what did that get them? Fuck off. That's what. Not even a decent burial. I don't know how to say that word probably, okay? But I know what it means. Da always said a wise man learns from others' mistakes. So here I am learning from his. And instead of dying for Tamaria, I'm going to rob those who killed Tamaria's sons. We've pitched the camp. Got us a great spot middle of the woods near that old mill. Now we're all set to go for our first aid. Okay, cool. Alchemist powder, a vial. Interrogation report and the diagram. Prepare to leave. Okay, hold on. Location. I'm at fortress. Person's taking part. Sir Ignatius. Okay. The Witcher. Cargram stands accused of kidnapping Vidi, son of Paul, a beekeeper residing in White Orchard. Hmm. Suspect was detained. Pending trial upon detention, he was searched and a diagram for the form of steel sword was found on his person. It is suspected this sword was used to intimidate or probably kill the kidnapped child. It is likewise suspected that uh, the accused that possesses other such diagrams for the form of death dealing implements, though none have been found to date. Sir Ignatius has uh, rescued, uh, requested the Witcher undergo preliminary interrogation with the application of torture. This will take place once a torturer with the proper qualifications has been found. Shit. The addendum. It was later discovered drowners were responsible for the boy's disappearance. Unfortunately, Hogram died before this information reached the investigators. But rather than face the uh, Baronet's judgment, he chose trial by ordeal. Sir Ignatius agreed uh, and ordered he cleanse the Ver Variarus family crypt of... Sp I'm sorry for all these terrible pronunciations, okay? I'm trying my best. Corgrim never emerged from from said crypt. It is highly likely the motley wraths, uh, specters, and evil powers residing therein prove too much for him. Quest updated. Scavenger hunt. Viper school. Diagram. So. Woo! We completed it. Okay. So, if I go here to my quest now. Yeah, that was pretty cool. Not gonna lie, that was pretty cool. That was more of a treasure hunt. Find the lost Tamarian treasure using your Witcher senses. I am gonna. Where'd I come from? I forgot. Over here. Oh, God! Okay, we're good. We're good. Everything's totally fine. Roach! Get the heck out of here before we get eaten alive by these damn dogs. Want to be dogs, wolves, whatever. You know what, Roach? You're a little bit too slow for being a horse. I'm already at the fast travel point. You, you're, you're deeming yourself invaluable right here, okay? Never mind you, dude. Jesus Christ. I will just fast travel over here. Let's see how fast it is fast traveling on PC. Pretty fucking fast. <laughs> I mean, your PS5 was uh, really fast as well. So, hey, I'm not. I'm more impressed with the fact that the PS5 was able to travel as fast as this. All right, so. 
Wait, wait, whoa! Oh! Oh, you guys want to kill me? You ever fight a Witcher? Yeah, you ever fight a Witcher, punk? One of your items is in bad shape. Repaired, otherwise it won't work as well. <laughs> Not my sword, right? Oh, fuck. Oh, it is my sword. How do I repair it? Uh... What is it? The Gildorf sword. Right now, it's not the time to figure this out. Oh my God, asshole. Oh yeah, I'm gonna die here. You guys want all the heat? Oh shit. Hey, the crossbow is pretty good. Ah! Fuck! Oh my god! Oh my god! Hold on, hold on. What is this? Uh. I'm still learning, bro. Like I, I came in here. Perhaps, perhaps a bit too quick. Great men lovers to work. Oh my God. Oh no. Oh God. Did I really just run? That's enough of that. Oh man, holy cow. Okay, I'm scared. What just happened? Dumpling, really? This man just gave me a dumpling? I'm gonna have to sell a lot of this crap. I'm gonna loot all this. Other scraps. Yeah, I gotta loot all this. Silver ore. Oh my gosh. Ooh. Hunting gauntlets. Okay, wolf hide. Damn. Rune stones can be used to enhance your weapons. Go to the equipment tab in your inventory and select a rune stone. Really? My weapon is actually extremely damaged. So do I really want to use this crap? All right, so select the weapon and press it. Oh my God. You gotta be fucking kidding me. Yeah, I need to take it to a, okay. I need to fix that. As far as for my clothes. Ooh, shit. Damn, Geralt, you're looking quite nice. Put that back on. Plus one. Those are probably better than the ones I had, right? Yep. For the boots, we have any... No, damn it. You better put some shoes on. <laughs> and now it's not the time. All right. Hopefully, there's no more trouble here. Destroying objects. Some objects that can be destroyed, such as... Uh, can be destroyed. Such objects are marked with the, an icon. To destroy the object, to open up a path, face them, and cast an art sign. You can also try hacking at them with your sword but uh, note that not everything can be destroyed in this manner another option is to toss a grape shot bomb ow okay damn Oh my God. We did it. Yes. I will take all of it. 
scribble do documents Himmy, no wonder we're losing this war with cowardly concepts for soldiers all it took were a few arrows and a wallop of the mace for seasoning and that was that battle was over and the whole convoy was ours for the picking maybe they were having such a hard time of it because of all the vodka they were carrying our brave warriors must have taken a sip from time to time but obvious results when you're seeing double it's damned hard to hit your target take everything we gathered to the to the cubby then fence it qu uh quick as you can except that's uh showy parade shit you will have to bury it or burn that i reckon someone might recognize this the insignia and yeah that'd be trouble Hey, this is pretty cool. Like these enhanced saddle. Look at that. I didn't know that was a thing. Manuscripts. We got some diagrams here. Well, that's quite interesting. Calvary boots. Okay, hold on. Let's go back to the character here. Excuse me. Inventory. Now we have here. Oh, these boots are better. Resistance. Okay. We are moving up in this world. Took a little while to get used to all this, guys. It's a lot to take in. Okay. But I am having uh, quite, a bl <laughs> quite a blast. Not going to lie. This is pretty cool. All right. So there's my horse. Brand new saddle. Can't be complaining too much. Got the latest and greatest, Roach. If I hear you complain just That's once, it, it's over for you. Benefits of this clan will be terminated for you, Roach. So right now, it seems like I need to upgrade or excuse me, repair my right sword. Oh, my, my right sword is silver. Isn't it the steel one I got to repair? One of them. It's got to be one of them. I see what happens here. Okay. Got Vesemir here. There's a chest over here. Oh. Oh, stash. You can store weapons, armors, and junk in your stash for safekeeping. Confident they will not be stolen or otherwise disappear. You can access your stash in a number of places throughout the world. Items stored in your stashes in one location will be available in all the other locations. Okay, cool. Yennefer's in Vizima. Got a few friends there, so... Something wrong? Look around. Trouble brewing. Who are they? Patriots, drinking their seventh round for Tamaria, fists starting to itch. Don't see any enough guardians. They'll find another foe. They'll buy some provisions for the journey, then we'll go. Hmm. Geralt, we should stay out of it just this once. Is Amir's beard growing a little bit? Maybe not. What happened to the lilies? Took them down. Took them down? To hang a golden sun there now? I cannot show Temerian colors. They'll come and burn the tavern down. Maybe it's true what they say. You fond of the Imperials? You Nilfgaard's whore? Oh. I'll let that pass. I know grief eats at your heart. No shit. They hang my sister, dragged her out the cloister like a dog. Said Nilfgaard's no place for superstition. That they don't fear the wrath of the gods. And you, do you fear it? If not for Annie, your child would have choked on its navel string. You owe your son to Let's my sister to the no. birth. And you don't oh. fear the gods' wrath. You don't oh. fear it, you cunt. Ah! Oh. Recognize this medallion? You know what it means. Back off. You all right? Wow. They say witches steal youngins. That true. What the emperor promise you, freaks? Your own land, like he did the elves once. Get out, all of you. We ain't going nowhere. Neither are you. They won't back down now. I can see that. Well, my sword is banged up. 
hopefully uh they're not too bad oh damn this is the upgrade i put on the sword to start her with all this violence <laughs> see his face god save us be gone and don't ever come back wow are you kidding me so much for not getting involved come on let's go started excuses excuses you've not changed a bit you, Yen how I received a report about a witcher who'd appeared in White Orchard I knew it was you looking for me I might have waited until you found me, but... Well, you know me. Patience has never been my strong suit. It's... Good to see you, Geralt. I... I'd even embrace you. Were you not covered in blood? Sorry. Wasn't expecting to see you. To be honest, this isn't at all how I imagined we'd meet. How did you imagine it? He didn't imagine you'd have a Nilfgaardian escort. Don't get me wrong, Yennefer. I'm glad to see you, but I do think you owe us an explanation. And I shall provide it, in Vizima. Ready your horses. Spent the last six months in the saddle. Haven't seen you for two years. Can we take a moment Sadly, to... we cannot. Someone awaits you, Geralt. Someone who doesn't like to be kept waiting. Emperor Emir Var Emrys. Or, to those on more intimate terms with him, the white flame dancing on the graves of his foes. Doubt I number among that group. For as I remember, last time we saw each other, he wanted to kill me. Well, now he wishes to make you an offer. The kind one can't refuse. I didn't, though I could have. <laughs> hmm. Must have been a damn good offer then. Not many things you'd give up your freedom for, and even fewer people. The sooner we set off, the sooner you'll find out. What about you? I'm going in the opposite direction. I somehow doubt the Emperor's invitation mentioned me. Besides, I've got things to do at Care Morhen, remember? Yeah, I remember. Aw. Thanks for your help, Vesemir. See you soon. Oh, I don't know, we're gonna get split up. How's your horse? Swift? Can't complain. Why do you ask? I'd like to be back behind some thick city walls as soon as possible. Yeah. Just the beginning, but then, but then. Is 
this another one of his dreams or is this really happening oh nice that was pretty clutch quick thinking like style Jennifer how they should talk of this tomorrow all right after the audience what is happening how far are we now from this bard's tale begins near White Orchard, with my dear friend Geralt of Rivia seeking his lover of yore, the sorceress Yennefer. She'd eluded him for years, but now seemed just a few steps ahead. After many trials and tribulations, Geralt finally learned that Yen was in nearby Vizima. Hmm. Oh, God. Here we go. Another bath for Geralt. Very, uh, very well deserved. We stink. And probably gonna blur this just in case. Hmm. It must suffice. <laughs> That's funny. Think of your cares if I'm clean. The gentleman will refer to his Imperial Majesty by his full title or not at all. The gentleman will be seated on the berger. The what now? In that chair. Tatwin, we shave the gentleman's sideburns to half an inch. What the heck? Clean cut? Yeah, you say I knew my beard was growing a little bit. What's wrong with my beard? Always thought it added to my dignity. It does. Yet it also detracts from your elegance. In Nilfgaard, we consider beards hard on the eyes. Especially beards infested with lice. Been on the road a uh -huh. while. Fine. Do your thing. Tilt your head back, please. And sit still. Getting a proper shave. Not bad. And prepare to answer some questions. General, I am not certain this is the appropriate time. I can't think of a better time. Men turn honest when they feel a blade at their throat. Ah. Movran Vuris, commander of the Alba Division. Before they take you in to see the Emperor, Witcher, there's some information I need you to verify. It's a formality, but one that must be seen to. Sure. Paperwork's gotta be in order. So, Geralt of Rivia. Place of birth, unknown. Parents, unknown. Age, unknown. All insignificant details. Let us proceed to more recent events. The siege of La Valette Castle. The fate of the defending commander one Arya. We fought on opposing sides, true. Then we landed in the same dungeon. Arian escaped, set fire to the castle on his way out. Ah. So that is how the blade started. Our reports suggested the dragon was responsible. Moving on. You then found shelter in charming Flotsam, mm. and from there made your way to Vergen. My question is how? I got out of Flotsam with Vernon Roach, commander of the Blue Stripes and- A murderer of non-humans. We know this gentleman well. You forge interesting alliances. Something tells me my most interesting is yet to come. <laughs> Go on, next question, before my beard grows back in. We shall shave you again if it does. Very well. The infamous summit at Loch Mui. You were there. And once again meddled in the affairs of the mighty. Not the way 
I see it. I helped a friend rescue a child. Anais was not just any child. She was a pawn in a game you did not understand. You and Roach did not rescue her at all. At most, you moved her from one edge of the board to the other, fanning the flames of conflict. Nilfgaard recently started a war, unprovoked. So do us both a favor and stop moralizing. The gentleman must sit still. I'm almost done. I'm afraid I might find that difficult. Because, from what I know, shortly afterwards you watched a defective megascope blow your friend Sheila de Tansoville to bits. Hmm. I watched her get in the megascope, but ultimately freed her from the trap your man Letho of Gullet had set. Write that down. I want to be sure the paperwork's in order now. Well, mm. national interest calls on one to forge difficult alliances at times. Alliances with witches included. That an ongoing alliance? What's Letho up to? I had hoped you would answer that question. Ah. So Letho's hiding from you. Must have a good reason. Was there a shift in national interest that might have caused that? I don't know where he is. Wouldn't tell you if I did anyway. Blade or no blade to my throat. I believe that is all. Hmm. Your signature, please. Affirming you stated the whole truth and nothing but the truth on pain of imprisonment or death, etc., etc. Here and here. With these formalities seen to, I would ask the general to leave the room. We shall be choosing the gentleman's attire. An important matter, but one that does not require <laughs> the general's assistance. Shame. I might have given you some advice. So long, Geralt. Good luck with your audience. Really? Feels more like I'm being readied for a wedding. Were that so, I would have prepared the gentleman a frock, a tailcoat, or possibly a dinner jacket. In point of fact, the gentleman will choose from these garments. Hmm. Where are my clothes? Where are my clothes? Where they should have gone long ago, with the laundress. They will be returned to you after the audience, ah. clean and starched. The gentleman will tell me once he has chosen an outfit. Okay. Oh, which one do I choose? I'm... Okay. That one looks pretty good. I don't know. I might go for that last one. Does that even matter? Hmm. Elf Guardian Elegance. Walking pipe. <laughs> I'll go for this one. Oh, you can get all of them? Wait. Oh, shit. Man, I didn't know that. Come on. All right, so let's get dressed. This one looks best. Looks more pimping. What the hell are these boots, man? It's ridiculous. Look like a dork. Oh my God. There is so much, like how long did it take for, for CDPR to like make this game? 
This is kind of insane. Like non-stop looting here. Vedimin, directly out of northern Italy. Black suits the gentleman. Does the outfit satisfy the gentleman? It's all right. A studded doublet and a sword on my back. That's what would satisfy me. But tough. When in Nilfgaard. Yes. It's a saying. So what now? Powder my nose? No need. The gentleman's complexion is light enough. The gentleman is to stand before the ruler of the north and south. I must confirm that he knows how to bow. Confirm away. Please watch. Yeah. Leg extended, hand flat, head down, chin to chest. The gentleman will rehearse. Okay, so left leg forward, right hand on chest, left leg back. This is absurd. Gotta be kidding. Not at all. I am mortally serious. Does the gentleman know the penalty for breaches of etiquette in the Emperor's presence? 200 lashes. Sheesh. I do not wish that upon him. So I will not let him leave until I am confident that he knows how to behave. Okay, so I think it was left leg forward, right? Hmm. Lacking fluidity and grace. But we've learned to expect less of Northling. <laughs> Come with me. I guess I got it right. I actually paid attention. The gentleman will address the Emperor only when asked to and using the appropriate type. Our arch magnificency. I see the gentleman is in the mood for jests. I fear the Emperor might not share his disposition. Your Majesty will suffice. Spoken loudly, clearly, and with respect. Hmm. There he is. In Grimmy et Art Kerzer. Dyfen Aden in Karn eb Marvut. Emir var Emreis. Wow. I think I did it wrong. Your Imperial Majesty. I'll accept the Witcher. We'll leave. Hmm. I thought you bowed before no man. Didn't want to disappoint the Chamberlain. We're friends. Hmm. Take it you didn't summon me to reminisce about the good old days, so... Silence. My daughter, Cyrilla, she's returned. And she's in danger. The wild hunt pursues her. You will find her and bring her to me. Are you sure? What? Siri left, went far, far away. Do you believe I drag you here in the middle of a war to discuss a rumor? I think anyone can be wrong, even an emperor. I had forgotten how insolent you can be. I haven't the time to convince you, nor the desire, in fact. Yennefer will do that after the audience. How many men in your army? 20,000? 30? So why me? You know why. Because she trusts you. She trusts me, yes. So tell me why you're looking for her. Doubt it's about making up for all those lost years. For reasons of state, as always. Enough of this banter. You will agree regardless. If for no other reason than because I shall pay you. More than you customarily receive for a contract. Considerably more.
save your generosity for those whose homes your armies have raised. I'll do it for Ciri, not for your gold. Your motives do not interest me, only results. Wow. Yennefer will tell you the rest. This audience is finished. Meririd! Take him to the sorcerers. If the gentleman pleases, please keep close. There are many honorable guests in the palace whom the gentleman disgusts need not bother. Very interesting. So we got to go rescue the little girl now. And it's past yes, noon. Yes, Calm yourself. What? what? Do you know who you're talking to, soldier? I'm Herevard the second. The scene has fallen the ground. So though yeah. I made to wait here like a supplicant. Yeah, the lighting looks really nice, huh? Look at the reflection on the ground and everything. It looks really freaking nice. And self it then sick yard. Say what? Caspa can be better than to member in her own house. Once the gentleman is done, he should see me to retrieve his possessions. Glen S. Plasser. Okay, so we've got to go here. Yes, then transcribe. The true authority in Novigrad is not the city council or the merchants. All right, let's go straight ahead and speak to Yennefer. Geralt, that tunic, you look positively smashing. Ugh, dying to take it off. I'd consider that a proposition under different circumstances. One I might even <laughs> take you up on. But we've matters to attend to. Now do you understand why I'm at Amir's court? Mm -hmm. And seems we're in the same boat now. Siri, she's really back? No chance he's mistaken? Look, that's more or less what she looks like now. Or so our agents claim. Our mm. little witch has grown into a young lady. Wow. How about that? She's grown up. It's been wow. years since you trained together at Care Morn. A great deal has changed. <laughs> you haven't. Not a bit. I missed those awkward compliments of yours. But let's focus on Siri, all right? Right. Amir said the wild hunts after her. I'd find that hard to believe before what happened yesterday. How did they track us down? Because of me. You see, I've spent months searching for Siri, using locating spells, haruspicy, geomancy, anything, really. I knew the wild hunt might sense it. Perhaps even find me, but I thought I'd trick them. Well, guess you were wrong. Mm. I've sensed them on my trail, hunting me for some time. If not for you and Amir's soldiers, they'd have gotten what they were after. I can't risk another encounter like that. It's time to put away the magic, turn to more traditional methods. To the best tracker I know. Mm. You must find her, Geralt, before the wild hunt does. The Wild Hunt. What could it want from Ciri? I've no clue, Geralt. Might have written them to ask, but I don't have their address. I know as much as you do. It must be about her blood. Her gift. As for what the Hunt wishes to do with that gift, I'd... I'd prefer not to think about it, really. So where's Ciri been seen, exactly? In two places. Velen and Novigrad. The trail in Velen is most promising. You should make that your first stop. Ask for a merchant named Hendrik at the inn at the crossroads. One of the Emperor's agents. He should get in touch with you. That's it? No passwords? Secret handshakes? None. Sorry to spoil your fun. Your boyhood fantasies about the craft of the trade. 
All we have in Novigrad are unconformed reports, rumors. But there you will have the help of our mutual acquaintance. Triss Merigold. Apparently she's got a cozy flat on the main square. Sure she'll be delighted to see me. What about you? What will you do? Hmm. I shall sail for Skellige. There was a magic explosion there recently. It blew half a forest down. I believe this had something to do with Ciri. I'll be in care trolled. Join me there once you've learned something. One thing before we go. Why didn't you contact me? Didn't need me? Didn't even want to see me? I didn't want to spoil things. I'd heard you and Triss made a great couple. Oh. Damn. I'd lost my memory. Really? That's your excuse? Let's drop it, all right? It's not what you think, or it helped me understand how much I love you. I don't wish to hear it. Any of it. Guess this means we need to split up again. Not my preference, but I understand. Clock's ticking. It is indeed. So why don't I teleport you to Vel and get you there at once? Not gonna happen. I'll go on horseback, as soon as I can get changed. Have it your way? Oh, and... You really look quite dashing in black velvet. Think so? Maybe I can mm -hmm. have some of my armor lined with it. <laughs> Good luck, Yen. Same to you. And if you wish to learn what's happened in the world while you and Vesemir roam the wilderness, talk to Ambassador Vartra. That's him over there. And Geralt, I know it's wartime, but try not to be a hero, all right? Just check those leads and come back to me in one piece. Hmm. I shall be waiting. Oh, okay, damn. That's that's some motivation right there. Motivation. Character entry added Hendrik. Retrieve your equipment from the. Oh my god. Seriously? My goodness. There is so much shit to read. What is this? Wow. That's her. Scars healed nicely. Is there anything else here that I can loot? I mean, I don't want to over loot because then I'm just going to get full, right? I mean, it's super tempting, but shit. It's locked. A shame I have no time. Ambassador Varatra, Yennefer suggested I ask you about current events, the war and so on. Of course. The Emperor's servants should keep no secrets from each other. If you will, let us approach the map. Hmm. How's the war going? I mean, apart from the fact that Nilfgaard's triumph is imminent. I assume this to be a private conversation. We've no witnesses, so let's dispense with the propaganda, even that shrouded in irony. Our offensive was going splendidly until winter came. Edern was in such disarray that we encountered no resistance. We had reached the Pontar before the first snows. Only a weakened Kedwin remained, and Radovid's Redania, which had ignored the rest of the North's pleas for help. We thought they'd sue for peace, perhaps even submit to vassalization. We waited for spring, Certain of victory. Radovid? Submit? Yes, a vain hope, I agree. Radovid sent no peace envoy, nor did he advance on our positions. Instead, he trudged over the snow-bound Kestrel Mountains and attacked Kedwin, his ally. This attack took the Kedweni by surprise. They were still mourning the loss of their king. Rudderless and dejected, they laid down their arms after a few lost skirmishes and joined Radovid. And so by spring, instead of two weak enemies, we had only one powerful one.
What about Kavir? Kavir values its neutrality. Enough not to lend its armies, or more importantly, even its coin to either side. Returning to the war, this spring there was a massive battle in the marshes of Velen. Massive, yet indecisive. Both sides suffered enormous losses. Unprecedented, even. Radovid has retreated across the Pontar. He's safe for now. Mm. Until reinforcements arrive from the south. Then Emperor Amir Var Emrys will deal with him once and for all. Couldn't you just go home? Save everyone a lot of marching, not to mention a few human lives. I'm afraid the stakes are too high to fold now. We can only go all in. Hmm. How do things look in Velen? As bad as ever. Perhaps worse. This land never flowed with milk and honey, and now it flows with blood. Armies have swept through it several times. Trampling fields, looting granaries, burning villages. Famine grips the populace. Mm -hmm. So how's ruling that earthly paradise going for you? Not well, to be honest. Our forces are spread thin as it is. And Velen is chiefly swampy forests that are difficult to control. We've had several patrols never return to their camps. Thus, we've temporarily delegated authority in this region to a certain Nordling. A former low-ranking officer in the Temerian army, one Philip Strenger. Better known by his nom de guerre, the Bloody Baron. I advise you well, avoid him. Hmm. Any news from Novigrad? Is the free city still free? Yes. Although everyone knows this won't last. Radovid is in Oxenfurt, and the Emperor is here, in Vizima, at Novigrad's doorstep, both. And both require coin and ships. Novigrad can provide these. Which is why the mood in the city is... rather... well, on edge. Meaning? How do men deal with fear? They seek reassurance. And scapegoats. The Church of the Eternal Fire understands this perfectly, and so it promises to improve the lives of its flock by pointing out the guilty. Who started the war? Who profits from it? Why, it's obvious. Mages, elves, dwarves, in a word, any and all deviants. I've been stationed in Novigrad for 13 years. Wow. First as a consul, then as ambassador. I've seen a great deal. Cruelty, cynicism, greed. But what is happening there now concerns me greatly. What's new in Skellige? Nothing. The islanders pride themselves on that, don't they? Doing everything according to tradition, as their forefathers did. And like their forefathers, they quarrel with each other. Pillage. Occasionally attack our transports. This is cumbersome. But nothing more. Skellige has always been a footnote to history. And so it shall remain. Sound hmm. awfully confident. What if King Bran manages to unite the Jarls? Lead all the clans against your fleet? King Bran is a feeble old man. From what I know, he barely remembers the names of his own vassals. Uniting all might prove difficult. Thanks for your help. That was a lie. Nothing of it. May the great sun light your path. Holy cow. Oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What, dude? Whoa. <laughs> that was a lot, man. Holy shish. How might I serve the gentleman? By returning my things. Citrus and cloves. The fragrance will keep the gentleman's robes fresh somewhat longer. Hmm. Thanks, bunches. Thought he was gonna the give him like a hug. <laughs> he wants his daughter back safe and sound as soon as possible. Yeah, mention something of the sort. So long. Overburdened. You are overburdened. Geralt is carrying too many items. If you load yourself down with too much loot, you won't be able to run or sprint. A symbol will appear on your screen to let you know that you're overburdened. You can check how much weight you're carrying in the inventory panel. Get rid of unwanted items by throwing them on the ground, selling them, or getting craftsmen to dismantle them. 
If you want to carry more, upgrade your horse's saddlebag. A deserter from the Skoya Ten. Imperial guidance. A hangman's tree. Okay, so. The Nilfgaardian Guardian connection. Gentlemen. Good. Trying to see if there's a freaking. Let me go to the map here. Is there a world map to switch content if you press tri. What the fuck? To return to the map region. We to open the map of a given region, move the cursor over that region and press X. What the hell is this? Bro. Dude. Are you kidding me? How big is this fucking map? Oh, well, this is not that big. Okay. I was trying to see where the... All right, listen, none of that is available. We do have a little side quest here. Fast travel. What is this? Quest available. We'll come back to that quest. Let me see. Um, Travel to Velen. Really? Hey, level five. I don't know, man. Geralt and Yennefer were reunited, but something even more important happened in Vizima. Geralt learned that Cirilla, his one-time ward, had returned from afar, and she was in danger. He was to find her at the Emperor's command and Yennefer's behest. That's so cool, like the animated, uh... Loading screens. Belen, Northern Temeria. Five days later. Oh my gosh. That's not good. Wow, look at that. A Hearts of Stone. Thank you for purchasing the Hearts of Stone expansion. Your currently tracked quest has been changed to the first quest of Hearts of Stone. Yeah, we only recommend starting it if your character level is... Yeah, let's not... Uh, a rune, rune Rites. While playing the Hearts of Stone expansion, you can encounter the Rune Rite marked with the book icon on your map. This new craftsman, the only of his kind, comes from a far off land and can... Uses arcane knowledge to considerably improve your equipment. Seek him out to see for yourself. Blood and wine. In this mode, all quests from the main storyline are still available to you. To begin playing quest from Blood and Wine, you must first complete a poet under pressure quest. Okay, so clearly, we're not going to do that. Quite freaking clearly. Shit. Quest difficulty. Some quests might be too difficult for you at the moment. Each quest has just the level shown below. Okay. Um. Wow. Okay. Man, this game is just stunning. Like I don't, I don't even know how to explain it. Are you guys seeing this? My gosh. CDPR, man. You guys are fucking wizards. Look at this view right now. Wild hunt. Take them all. You, white one. What's your business? Run. 
I'm sorry. I'm not speaking much right now. I'm just, uh, all right. Enough is enough. Roach, stop. Let's get out of here. We've got another billboard there with uh, new quests and stuff. Go ahead and, uh, let's keep going. Oh shit. Let me help this guy out. Probably a bad idea. Monster tooth. Nice. I need to stop picking shit up. Unbind me before the next ones come. When they come, I'll tend to them. Meanwhile, let's you and me chat. Like to know who I'm untying. John Verdon. Served in the 10th Maribor Division. Long way from your army. The army don't exist no more. Black ones smashed it to bits. I scarped off into the woods just before that happened. Hmm. Join a group of refugees. Fucking bursting with patriotism, they were. As soon as they learned I'd abandoned Tamaria in her hour of need, they beat me down. Tied me up like a turkey, left me to the drowners. Hmm. Fine, I'll help. Oh, thanks. For a minute there, I was almost sure you'd leave me to die. I'll help you out, bud. Don't do anything stupid. I'd like to thank you somehow, but I'm not a chip crown to my name. Tough. I'll take the loss. <laughs> Thanks, Witcher. May you prosper on the path. I like being a good guy. Yeah, we need to go somewhere ASAP where I can get rid of some of this crap. At least I get, at least get something for or discarding some of the items, right? I mean, at least that I can do. I don't want to just get rid of shit. Oh, man. Now, this is getting even better than before. Like, I thought where we were at was cool. But now, like, we're venturing off into, like, a whole different area. This is fucking gnarly, man. Wow, bro. Like, this is incredible. Strangers coming. Run for your lives. But go to the inn at the crossroads. So I'll slaughter on myself. Hide your corpse beneath the floorboards. Those bastards won't have it. Hello? Alright, where's. Is there a safekeeping chest here? I need one of those. I'm looking for one of those. I can barely walk. I'm walking slow as shit. All right. Okay, I'm just going to speak to these people here and see if I can find the chest later on. I'm, I'm growing impatient right now. Looking for a man. Goes by Hendrik. What do you want with him? Want to talk to him. What about? Give me a bottle of something strong. That's not good. You gotta go. I'll open the back way for you. Got company. Who is it? In Cape Vorka. Who's this? It? Mm. Brave warrior looks like. Got two swords, see? Oi, great boy. What's the point of having two swords? Wonder if he keeps an extra prick in his trousers too. You fucking deaf. Gonna say who you are? Or do I need to loosen your tongue with me knife? Someone who'd prefer not to be bothered while he's having a drink. <laughs> Hear that? 
We've a distinguished gentleman in our midst. Shine your boots, governor. No. Wouldn't want the grime in your hands to rub off on them. <laughs> Let's go. Oh. Did you hear what I heard? Go away, or I'll kill you. Damn it. Enough. Oh, boy. Shut up. Man, I just got here. I don't want any trouble. Fuck it. You asked for it. Ow. Oh. Some good damage you're doing there, man. Yeah, you like that? When push comes to shove, I push. Come on. Easy, bro. Easy peasy. Have you any idea what the Baron will do when he learns of this butchery? The village. He'll tear it apart before anyone can say it was some wandering mutant done it. An iron fist he's got. Where's Hendrik? You deaf? Understand what I'm saying? Baron won't let this stand. Calm down. Your Baron's hmm. no idiot. Seriously doubt he'll think you locals cut his men down with farming implements. Now, where's Hendrik? Man lives in Heatherton. Don't know where that is. Other side of the hill. Look that away this morning and saw a strange glow. Imperials on the raid, perhaps. But who knows? Anything else you can tell me about Hendrik? Odd fellow. Arrived from who knows where and for no apparent reason. Shacked up with a widow whose husband was stabbed for a scrap of bread. Baron's men don't like strangers. Mm. Aye. He stays out of their way. Always seems to know when they're coming. Always manages to disappear. Thanks, Inkeep. Go out the back. Or the Baron's men in the village. No need to worry about me. I'd rather you not make any more trouble for yourself or us both. All right, so. Probably sh shouldn't be looting this. I'm already heavy enough. What have you done to our boys? Come on, boys. Oh, I can't block that. Okay, well, I'm an idiot for thinking I could. Oh, shit. You can do a finisher. Cool. So I'm thinking that that the, the 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 head of the beast I can probably I could have probably sold it. I'm I'm starting to think that because I don't think we're gonna be riding with that shit all day long, all play through long on our on our horse. Like that, that just doesn't make any sense. They're strange, like dropping into a deep cellar on a hot day. In the mist. All right, so I've dropped a couple of things now. I can move much faster. When I go here, look at these rabid dogs. Something to fear. Yeah. Ow, ow. Holy shit. Bro, what? That's right, Roach. Oh my God. He just kicked the shit out of him. Oh my God. I would have died. I would have freaking died. Be gone. Leave me be whoever you is. Get away. Calm down. It's over. Oh my gosh. Roach just saved me. Second time he does that. <laughs> Aye, it's over. All's past, never to be restored. I'll not forget that ever. Looking for a man named Hendrik, supposed to live in this village. Aye, he did. No longer. They nabbed him in that hut. Wow. If you'd have heard the cries, sir. If you'd have heard how a man can scream. 
how he can suffer. Tell me what happened here, step by step. They took him. Took him all. The sun was waning, see? And the dusk went crimson like blood. Thought to myself, strange. The tones, I cannot hear them. During a winter. the terrors yet the village froze like in the heart of winter you in that hut when they rode off no and i'll not set foot there never farewell and peace of mind to you <laughs> so where is he find the agent called hendrick what is this just wonderful Oh, damn. Tortured him. Maybe they missed something. Need to check his pockets. Trousers are stiff, as if hung out to dry midwinter. Maybe hid something in his jerkin. What's damn, he's cold as ice. Nothing here. Should check his boots. Blood his boots. congealed. Key hidden in his boot. Is that Got it? For the keyhole. Somewhere nearby, hopefully. Oh, nice. Push for the agent's huts using uh the senses. A platter. Examine. Beneath his bed, kind of like Kratos. A draft. Got to be a space under this rubble. Guess I should do some cleaning. Ah. Really? Hey, this is wild. Tamara Stringer, daughter of the Bloody Baron, presumed kidnapped. Party reward for whoever finds her. Or brings her in. That'd be a possible side quest. Well, well, well. Valuables left unlocked on display. Almost lost his mind, or hmm. okay. What else? Just to loot this. Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. interesting. Okay. <laughs> Hidden contraption. Examine. Maybe this is his findings. Got the intel. The ledger. 
payment for a sack of grain, mm. amount due for a charcoal shipment. Hendrik was masquerading as a merchant. Mm. Hmm. What's this? Notes among the ledger entries. Clever. Interesting headings. Missing and wanted. Subject appeared in Skellige. Also sighted in Novigrad. Appearance unchanged. Ashen hair. Scar on her face. Avoids contact with others. Hmm. Drunken swine. So-called Baron hosted subject at his castle. Or should I say, illegally appropriated fort. Reason unknown. Talked to Baron at Crow's Perch. Clashed with a witch. Subject landed in swamp, encountered a witch. Conflict ensued. Cause unknown. Find the witch. Talk to the peasantry. Village of Midcops. Caution advised. I'm being observed. Don't know by whom or why. Unsettling signs. Dog ran off. Water in bucket froze solid. Strange glow observed in the sky. Ill omen, peasants say. Hmm. Somehow they learned Hendrik was looking for Siri. Thus the torture. Yep. I'm too late. My only leads, the Baron, and some, some witch. witch. Damn. Go to the Baron's castle. The Baron's castle. Interesting. Okay, and then we have a chest there. Okay. So now... So I actually went over there... And I'm probably going to cut it out of the video, but I went over there and it was blocked, like, the area where the chest was at. Um, yeah, this man died because, obviously, of the notes that he had on Siri hunting a witch. All right, so, guys, I think we're going to end it here. There is a lot, a lot of storytelling, a lot of dialogue in this game. It's definitely a massive RPG game. Possibly one of the biggest, if not the biggest, I've played next to Valhalla. Maybe even bigger. I don't know. But, um, man, it's it's really well done. Like, this is pretty impressive. Um, this is also The Witcher 3 next-gen update on PC. Let me know what you guys thought. Compared to the first video we did on PS5. And, uh, yeah, let me know what you think. Um, I don't know if this will be a full series. If, if you think we should... Let me know down below. These videos would have to be, would have to do exceptionally well because um, I know this would be like a long one, like months of playing. So uh, we'll see. Anyways, thank you guys, and I'll catch you on the next one.